Hi guys, welcome back, welcome back to Arkelos. How have you been? How is everybody by the way? We haven't heard from a lot of people in a while. So please tell me, give me an update on how everybody's doing. Christian, how have you been my dude? And Jan Stanek and everybody else, how is everyone? So we're back uh, assembling our A team. So, Kandak is the next guy I want to recruit. So, may I disturb your prayer? Kandaku, czy mogę przeszkodzić ci w modlitwie? Oczywiście. Z tobą zawsze chętnie porozmawiam. Nie zakłócajmy jednak modlitwy pozostałych i spotkajmy się na zewnątrz. Okay, let's go outside and chat then. So, Kandaku. Is that how Polish people really uh, change names? Is is it like an inflection or a conjugation or how certain words are I don't know modified his name is Kandak is that not how you pronounce it in Polish as well so let's talk to Kandak Dobrze. Jak mogę ci pomóc? I'm going to go into a tomb my boy przygotowuje się do wyprawy podczas której mamy odzyskać pewien artefakt dla magów wody Szukam wojowników, którzy pomogą mi się przedrzeć przez armię nieumarłych, zajmujących podziemne korytarze Wardal. Nie musisz nic więcej mówić. Mój konsekrowany miecz już dawno nie miał okazji przysłużyć się oczyszczaniu świata z pomiotów Beliara. Chętnie wyruszę z tobą do Wardal i upewnię się, że pokorni słudzy Adanosa otrzymają artefakt, którego potrzebują. Thank you very much. I knew you could count on me. Wiedziałem, że mogę na ciebie liczyć. Dziękuję, że to ja mogłem liczyć na ciebie. Gdy sam byłem w największej potrzebie, będę czekał na miejscu. Do zobaczenia. Okay, so I trust Kandak. He's our bro, just like a Caramon. He's our bro. Okay, he's gonna chill there and he go until he goes to Vardal itself. Okay, so the next guy we want to recruit. I decided on the, on the team, but since we're going to Vardal, let's talk to all our friends because all of our friends. Uh, how are you doing? Co? Jeśli planujesz zapuszczać się w go. Yeah. Uh, let's see what he has. Uh, not that interesting. Okay. Uh, we pretty much talked to everybody in the monastery. Which means that uh, we need to take them one at a time. So let's go. Let's first go to Selbach. And let's talk to everybody in Selbach. It's gonna be an episode where we talk to our people. So we're gonna take it one place at a time. So let's go to Selbach first. And we have a lot of friends. We made a lot of relationships. I really love because it feels like uh, it's a uh, payback. Hey, uh, how are you doing? I feel like it's uh, not a payback. It's a payoff for all the good things Marvin has done in the game. Hey. Uh, how are you doing? Mom, uh, I have nothing to sell to you, Jill. So we haven't exactly been friends. Hey. What about Albin? So Albin has nothing to say. Ramsey. Okay, so Ramsey is still uh he still thinks Ezekiel. Nie jest to może najłatwiejszy kawałek chleba, ale z odpowiednim podejściem na archolos można nieźle zarobić jako handlarz. Zastanawiam się nawet nad dołączeniem do gildii kupieckiej. Ale teraz jesteś ważną osobą. Pewnie nawet nie masz czasu tego wysłuchiwać. Proszę, przyjmij ten mały podarunek. W ramach podziękowania za twoją pomoc. Gdyby nie to, że nie pozwoliłeś mi wtedy zostać na tej plaży, nie byłoby wtedy nikogo, kto mógłby wspominać moją córkę, ani pomodlić się przy jej grobie. Jeszcze raz dziękuję. O, I love that. Na razie powoli. I love that uh, all the people we've interacted with will have something interesting to say. Uh, so, uh, what did we get from uh, old man Ezekiel? We got a package. I shouldn't open it until inside the tomb. Okay, 
Rolf. Rolf doesn't have anything to say. Uh, farmers, farmers, we talk to Havert. Talk to the farmers. Uh, Uwe. Does Uwe have hey, anything to give us? How are you doing? Yeah. Uwe doesn't have anything to say. Okay. We already talked to Lokvar. What about Forsten? Uh, how are you doing? Uh, we're getting uh Hey te. We're getting few inputs. How are you doing? Yeah, poor Brucey. I wonder what happened to Bruce. Okay, so Let's see, does the baker have uh, Paola the baker? Can you give me some cookies for the expedition? So, what does he have? Grape tart, sweet blueberry bun? Nah. Not gonna need that. Victor, Victor, my friend. Uh, I'm preparing for a, a dangerous expedition and need some equipment. Się do misji i będę potrzebował wyposażenia. Aż mi się przypomniały czasy, gdy dopiero dotarłeś do wioski i nie miałeś nawet kilku sztuk złota przy sobie. Trzymaj. To powinno trochę pomóc. Wielkie dzięki, Victor. So I also need a favor. Have you ever taken care of a dog? Zajmowałeś się kiedyś psem? Zawsze lubiłem zwierzęta, ale niestety nigdy nie miałem psa. Czemu pytasz? Słuchaj, jakiś czas temu przygarnąłem w mieście psa. Ruszam na wyprawę i chciałbym, by ktoś zaufany się nim zajął. Byłbyś chętny? Jeszcze pytasz? Jasne, że chcę. Skoro i tak stoję tu na warcie, to miło by było mieć jakiegoś przyjaciela do wspólnego pilnowania. Okay, I have to say goodbye to him and I'll bring Muszę him to Silbach. Muszę się z nim pożegnać i przyprowadzę go do Silbach. Spokojnie. Dobrze się nim tutaj zajmiemy. Nie mam co do tego żadnych obaw. Dzięki. Okay, so we talk to the people here. Uh, let's see if our good old friend, the innkeeper, Bastion, hey. has uh, something to say. Mogę kupić u ciebie trochę prowiantu? Marvin, dobrze się widzieć. Nie myśl sobie, że zapomniałem o tym wszystkim, co dla nas zrobiłeś. Mam tutaj jeden nieotwarty worek z warzywami. Weź go dla siebie. Niech ci się przyda. So provisions from Bastion. Oh, so all of these things we can't actually open until... Uh, I won't open it inside the tomb. Oh, this is cool. Hey, ty. Marfa, what's new? Co nowego? Jak nie plotki, jak... Okay, so you're still a grumpy old woman. And you're still a drunken pervert, Rick. How's life? Yeah. So I love because uh, this quest is a this is like a goodbye quest for all the NPCs you came across uh, the game. I love it. It reminds me on uh, how in Mass Effect um, Two you can. Uh, You have a lot of different endings uh, depending on uh, who you pick uh, based on your team. So, nope. Not, not this chick. Uh, there, there was a woman here somewhere. I think it was in this house. Yeah, I think it was that house. Uh, the butcher. Has the butcher hey. warmed up to us yet? How are you doing? He still doesn't like us. So I guess we probably picked a dialogue option that at a certain point he didn't enjoy. Finia, how are you doing? So sweet. You are most welcome, Finia. Ah, this body of refugee. Yeah, dude. Tell me about it. I know what it's like to be a refugee. Oswald, how are you doing? So sweet. Uh, bye bye, Wildemill. I'm also gonna do a nice uh, montage at the end, saying goodbye to everybody. So I think this is uh, all the people we can talk to in Silbach. I think we can also talk to um, Roscoe, I think his name was. I doubt these guys, these uh, sentries, will have anything else to say because they're kind hey, of uh, kind of assholes. 
yeah, uh, he doesn't have any more training because uh, we surpassed him. This poor farmer is still beaten up. Hang in there. You too, girly. You too. Hang in there. Everything's gonna be alright because um, Marvin and Adrian are on the case. How are you doing? I don't know you, leave me alone. Seriously? Dude, I'm a badass warrior. Hey, ty. Nie widzisz. Actually, I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't recognize us. Compared to how scrawny and vulnerable. <laughs> Man, how we were at the end of the beginning of the game. Everything was so hard. We had no money. We had nothing. Hey, ty. Mike. Uh, how's life? Cześć, Marv. Jestem zajęty. Cześć, Marvin. Jestem zajęty. Leave me alone. Okay. Is it the refugees have money for swamp weed, though? Or tobacco? So, Rasko, why so depressed, my friend? Mam dla uh, I have no more joints. How are you? <laughs> okay, let's go to Rita's vineyard because we also helped Rita out. And after Rita's vineyard, we're gonna go to the sailor's retreat. We're also gonna go um, to the Valerio vineyard as well because we helped people there as well. Uh, Marcus uh, will have made his way to Vardal, by the way. So we can't find him in his regular place. All right. Uh, don't see any other mob respawns. I think we pretty much cleared the map. I mean, I checked it earlier. Doesn't seem to be like any other uh, monsters have been spawning about. <clears throat> oh, my speed potion wore off. Yeah. Let's pop the big ones, the extended speed potions. Yeah, by the way, let me ask you guys. Do you guys have any knowledge of a mod or uh, anything that implements a uh, speed mechanic in the game, a sprinting mechanic in the game? Because I don't want to cheat, I can always just turn Marvin mode on and sprint, but I kind of want to do it legit, you know what I mean? Uh, farmer, farmer, refugee, refugee, uh, farmer, Rita! Can I buy some food from you? Mógłbym u ciebie zakupić trochę żywności? Uprawiamy tu głównie winogrona i dynie, ale oczywiście mogę przygotować specjalny pakunek prowiantu. Ostatnio sporo mi pomogłeś. Te wszystkie bestie pewnie zjadłyby połowę moich plonów, a pewnie i kilku pracowników. Potraktuj te zapasy jako moje podziękowanie. Thank you very much. I actually feel like this crossbow is getting in the way. Oh, thank you very much. So, these chicks, I think we... Yeah, uh, we saved these ones from the... From the ship. This is the refugee we lent money to. Uważaj na siebie. Take care of yourself as well. I love honest people. Uh, who else do we have over here? Refugee Bowles. This was the guy that was guarding the bridge. jakości. Dla ciebie to pewnie praca marzeń. Owszem, mogę pić, e, znaczy degustować, ile tylko trzeba, a nawet więcej. Masz, spróbuj. Gwarantuję, że nie pożałujesz. Sam też wrócę do pracy. Okay, so we got a uh, Samara Zola wine. Well, I did see having fun. Hey, hey Nick. What's new? Co nowego? Gdyby nie twoja pomoc. Okay, so Nick doesn't have anything else to say. How are you doing? Okay, so these refugees actually don't have uh, 
anything to contribute. What about uh, this chick that was working down here, Nayla? Hey, ty. Uh, what's new? Co nowego? Gdy tylko Gaspar opuścił wyspę, Rita wywaliła z domu całą jego kolekcję różności związanych. Trzy tygodnie narzekała, jaki jest on głupi. W zasadzie... Ja... Yeah. Gaspar was... A... Wait a second. Could we have... Am I stupid? Could we have... Stored the... Okay, I need to secure the roof of the warehouse with these. Uh, yeah, yeah, this is, a. Uh, this is not what I, uh, was looking for. Could we have stored the wine, Marvin's wine, Gumbert's wine here? Or could we have simply delayed the quest for Gumbert? Hmm, that's interesting. So, yeah, if you guys know, uh, the answers to those questions, if we can delay the quest for Gumbert, for better reward. What? Is that a promotion? Is that a random encounter? What's going on here? Seriously? Oh, that was clever! That was clever! Volker senses regards. That was a that was a nice quality bait. It was a nice ambush. And man, this armor actually feels pretty damn solid. Huh. Go figure. And here I thought I actually explored all the random encounters. Huh. Good to know. Good to know. Okay, so we're done with uh, Rita's vineyard. We get a package from her as well, which is pretty cool. Bye bye, Rita. And I hope Gaspar is gonna make it through the war. Now we're gonna go to the Wolf's Den. After the Wolf's Den, we're gonna go visit the. Not the woodcutters, the. Whatchamacallit? The Sailor's Retreat. Yes. The Sailor's Retreat. Okay. Just love it. Your this quest kind of is very well designed. It's incredibly well designed because it encourages you to explore the entire map. It puts you into a meditation state where you just think about the game, think about all the adventures Marvin has had so far, and he's had quite a lot. Marvin has been through a lot. <clears throat> it just makes you think, you know. Also, it encourages you to keep exploring parts of the map in case you miss some things, which is also pretty cool. So let's uh, talk to the call makers, not the woodcutters. See if they have uh, anything to say. Czy dostanę od ciebie trochę węgla drzewnego? Trzymaj. Ostatnio Ulryk płaci nam tak dobrze, że mogę pomóc komuś w potrzebie. Pamiętaj. Nigdzie na wyspie nie dostaniesz tak dobrych krzesiw i węgla drzewnego. So, equipment from the charcoal burners. Co? Nie często się to u mnie zda. Jeśli chcesz sprawdzić, czy wypalony, gdy usłyszysz wyraźny brz... Nie... Ah, okay, so yeah. Uh, what about Gerd? Gerd, what do you have to say? Słyszysz, odkąd pozbył wielkie... Ah, uh, you're welcome from getting rid of the snappers. Tonan! We're gonna end uh, the dialogue with you. Elias, are you okay? Wszystko. Nie do końca, tylko czekać. Aż... Dlaczego mieli? Bo Helmut zaczął dogadywać się z Ulrykiem, a to jest im. Podobno Knud już ma problem. Zdania nie zmienię. Król. Yeah, okay, so you're worried, huh? Dwa lepiej. Tu postrzyka, tam. Okay. That was uh, Elias. So we got a uh, package from the Colders, which is pretty nice. Uh, Nut is no longer in his camp. He moved to the city. So let's talk to people in the wolves then. Man, I just love this armor, by the way. Looks so sweet. Looks so nice. Let's see. Who else can we talk to? Oh, do you know who we haven't spoken to yet? I forgot about him. 
We haven't spoken to the novice who be who was uh, this guy's son, Gaston's son. Hey. Didn't speak to him. Dude, you have two living children, so be happy. Hey, dude. Hi, Lucy. Well, it happens, man. With age, such things happen. So let's see, who can we talk to? Krednar. Co słychać? Zawsze wiedziałem, że ci nasi górnicy dokopią się kiedyś zbyt głęboko i będą z tego same problemy. Yeah, they dug too greedily and too deep. For all, teach me. Yeah, this guy teaches us extraction, but we're at uh, max right now. So let's see, who else can help us? What about Gretel? How are you doing? Yes, you have quite a rich assortment of stuff that I do not need. Thank you very much. Uh, Khaled, what's up? Yeah, 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 I can understand. Legref, how are you doing? Okay, Lucas, what's up? Okay. What hey. about Dirk? Nope. Doesn't have anything to tell me. Uh, this drunken guy. What are you doing? Uh huh. Yes, I'm sure they are stressful. Hey, dude. Gloria. Uh, I doubt anybody in the wolves then can actually help us. Maybe base. Because we kept his secret, right? So, Wolfson, no. Refi? How's the service? Okay. No news. No random encounters either. What's up? Oh, you're welcome for the concern. Base. Uh, how's the situation? Did he say fiscal hey, control? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the people here have more fiscal control. <laughs> That's an interesting way of putting things. Wow, just 600 gold pieces we have left. I'm actually curious. Is anybody going to fix that pipe? Hey. Yes, again. How's the research? Oh, okay, so you have the same old, same old. Good to know. So Yesagan doesn't have anything for us. I wonder if Einar might have a package for us, considering all the help we gave him. Uh, Lean, I didn't interact much with Lean. The people in the city, though, they should have some stuff for us. So Ulrich, how's the situation? W mieście mają teraz sporo zabawy z wysłannikiem królewskim. Okay, so nothing from Ulrich, huh? Well, in that case, let's just uh, check up on Einar and his buddy over here. Uh, there should also be Devil hey. practicing. What's up? Yes, you're busy. Okay, Einar, do you have anything for me? Uh, how are you doing? Fakt, że królewski wysłannik uczepił się miastowych i... Okay, show me your weapons. So he has a bunch of weapons. This glaive is pretty cool. Two-handed talent bonus, dexterity required. Now, we don't really need anything he has, do we? So... Can I upgrade my armor anymore? I cannot. Okay. Can I downgrade my armor? <laughs> no, apparently we cannot. That's nice to know. Show me how to become stronger. Nah. How are you doing? Okay, so that's about uh, all that Einar has to say. Alright, so we're done with the wolves then. In that case, let's uh, go to the sailors' retreat. See if the sailors there have uh, anything to tell us. 
Anything interesting to... Shower us with gifts, preferably. So, where's the sailor's retreat? Okay. So, let's do a face plant. Ba boom Boom! Alright, so there's this guy in the cave. I'm not sure if he has anything for us. But I think there should be at least one person should have something for us. A balni? Jestem zajęty. Jestem zajęty. Everybody's busy. Everybody's busy. Nobody wants to talk to Marvin. It will never open, yeah? What if I, uh, if I go, go through it? So yeah, I think the, by the way, I think the hidden secret room uh, in the source, I think that's part of the guard's quest. So hey. Yannick. Yannick. Uh, how are you doing? Okay, I have no more business with you. Fine. Uh, Roy. Roy, my friend. Are you willing hey, to dude. give me a gift? What are you doing? Uh, what can I buy from you? Okay, nothing interesting. Uh, no dark mushrooms, no apples, no nada nada nada. Sven! He is still pissed off at me. Zack! Nie masz może trochę ryb na zbyciu? Potrzebuję prowiantu na pewną wyprawę. Nie powiem, żeby ryby brały lepiej niż zazwyczaj, ale dla tak pomocnych ludzi jak ty, zdecydowanie znajdzie się jakaś skrzynka świeżych rybek. Okej, okay, so Zachary Fishbox. Liman, how are you doing? Jak leci? Na wyspie już w zasadzie... Okej, Karen. Co słychać? Nic nowego, Marvin. Zastanawiam się, czy... Yeah, in my cannon and head cannon, Marvin does leave with uh, cannon at a certain point. Okay, so we're done uh, with the sailors' retreat. Good to know. Uh, the beekeepers. Oh yes, we also have to visit the beekeepers. Pretty much have to visit uh, all the people we've interacted with. Well, people we had significant interactions with, actually. Because people like, for example, those in the wolves, then we didn't interact much with them. But honestly, I would have expected more from uh, from them, especially Einar. Although, although, if we're being honest, Einar did help us. He did help us with a free upgrade, so. Can't ask for more than that. We did save a couple of thousand gold pieces. Oh, there's a fallen tree I missed. Good to know. Okay, so we're gonna visit the beekeepers. We're also gonna visit the gold mines. See if we can actually talk to anybody there. I honestly don't think so. <clears throat> Uh, because we can't actually enter the gold mine. Well, we can actually clip through it. I mean, we can't enter it. It's not a question of whether we can or can't. It's just that the game doesn't expect us to be able to enter it. That's the thing. So what do we have here? Anything interesting in this cave? Nah. Same old, same old. Bunch of skeletons. Okay, so visit the beekeepers. Probably gonna get a package of honey from them. After we visit the beekeepers... Thinking of visiting Valerio's Vineyard. They should have some interesting uh, stuff for us. So let's take it one at a time. Ergo! Stop smoking so much, man. Uh, what's up? Yeah, our with the sky... Okay, uh, Pevin. Hey. You once mentioned that honey preserves food well. Wspominałeś <coughs> kiedyś, że miód dobrze konserwuje żywność. To prawda. Niektórzy magowie twierdzą nawet, że czysty miód nigdy się nie zepsuje. Mógłbyś przygotować dla mnie większą dostawę tego miodu? Normalnie sprzedajemy tylko tutaj pojedyncze słoiki, a cała reszta wędruje do gildii kupieckiej. Ale gdyby nie twoja pomoc w tej sprawie z niedźwiedziem, 
To pewnie połowa naszych uli byłaby już potrzaskana. Weź tę skrzynkę i życzę smacznego. Okej, okay, let's Handlu deal. Does he have anything else other than honey? No, just a bunch of water, country apple pie. How are things going? Orkowie! Orkowie na wyspie! Well, there are no more orcs, orcs on the island, I made sure of that. I can promise you that much. Can I actually light up this one? Oh, I can't? Huh, interesting. Marvin doesn't actually react to it. Huh. I guess they automatically light up at 8 a.m. Alright, so let's see. Who else do we need to visit? Do a quick visit to the gold mine. Uh, no, not here. Oh, we also need to visit the salt mine. Maybe they're gonna have uh, additional dialogue. Hmm. Let's see, does the mine boss have anything else to say? Finn doesn't have anything else to say. What about... Hello, Mr. Blacksmith. So what does he has? He has a bunch of gold nuggets. And we can exchange gold nuggets for coins. But actually we don't have a lot of nuggets left. Yeah, we only have eight. And I think they might be useful, might be, in Vardal. I'm not entirely certain if they are. Uh, does the guard? The guard doesn't have anything else to say. So yeah, we can probably clip through easily, right? Yeah. This is how e I actually didn't know this until I played Arcolos. I, I didn't know we, we could clip through stuff so easily. And... Uh, all of the veins are still depleted, so pretty much means that, yeah, can't actually do anything around here. Um, maybe, 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 just maybe. Uh, and maybe hey, Heisner? Uh, no, Heisner doesn't have anything else to say. Huh. So yeah, I knew from Gothic 2, I saw some speedrunner uh, tricks that where people cliff through item, uh, through certain walls, and I thought that was possible only with certain walls, or in certain places where they had collision bugs or problems with the meshes, but I didn't think it was possible to do it every time consistently with every gate, almost every wall. So go figure. Okay, so it seems that um, mm, it's not possible to get anything from the gold mine itself. So we're gonna go towards Valeria's vineyard right now. Uh, probably gonna take this shortcut over here. I also want to visit the guy. Uh, what was his name? Come on, Marvin, please climb up. Thank you. I just want to visit that guy, whatever his name was, that was by the river. Oh, so many people in Arcalos. In the music, in the environment soundtrack. Damn. I'm gonna miss this game so much when I finish it. I'm gonna want to replay it, but uh, I'll replay it if they ever put out the 2.0 hardcore version. Actually, I'm curious how they're gonna make a hardcore version of Arcalos because it's way, it's way too easy at this point. <laughs> the economy is uh, well done. I have to say, the economy is well done. But the gameplay itself, it's way, way, way too easy. The very fact that... What's this? Is this an ambush? Are these Volker's men... Disguised as guards. Oh, this is Duster. There you are. I was just looking for you. Tutaj jesteś. Właśnie cię szukałem. Mnie? O co chodzi? Jestem teraz trochę zajęty. Mam specjalne rozkazy od Rodericha. 
Uh, I have a job offer. Mam dla ciebie propozycję pracy. Przygotowuję się do wyprawy i potrzebuję eksperta od pozbywania się sporych ilości głazów. Twoim zadaniem byłoby koordynowanie górników i ewentualne użycie prochu, tak byśmy mogli bez większych trudności zbadać całe ruiny. Ech, sam nie wiem. Mam już całkiem przyjemną posadę w straży. Nie wiem, czy w tym momencie potrzebuję zmian. Uh, you'll receive a special deposit for the equipment you need. You'll be able to take as much gold from the vault as you can carry. Będziesz mógł zabrać ze skarbca tyle złota, ile tylko uniesiesz. Czyli mówisz, że będzie tam cały skarbiec do ogłoszenia? O, przyznaję, brzmi to zachęcająco. Uh, you'll receive a special deposit for the equipment Otrzymasz you need. specjalny zadatek na potrzebne wyposażenie. I to ja rozumiem! Bez porządnego prochu i solidnych lądów nie ma nawet co myśleć o wysadzeniu. Uh, 400 gold pieces. We have that. Świetnie! To powinno w zupełności wystarczyć. To jak będzie? Mogę na ciebie liczyć? Jest jeszcze jedna sprawa. Nie uh -oh. mogę się stąd ruszyć, dopóki nie załatwię tej sprawy z beczkami. Bezpośrednie rozkazy od Rodericha. Sam rozumiesz. Sam bym wszedł, ale... Niezbyt przepadam za wysokościami, a tym głupką nie powierzę więcej mojego prochu. Jedną beczkę już rozbili wchodząc po drabinie. Weź te dwie beczki, wejdź na górę i rozstaw z jednej i drugiej strony tej kłody. Tylko uważaj, żebyś nie spadł. Wolałbym nie zbierać twoich resztek ze ścieżki. So that's interesting. So we have uh... What happens if I fall? Does Marvin go boom? So we need to climb up there, huh? Climbing up there isn't that difficult. I think we can climb up here, right? So we have two barrels of gunpowder. How do the barrels look like? Uh, give from Ezekiel. Won't open it. Haha, <laughs> Marvin doesn't... Uh, okay. Marvin doesn't uh, want to throw them on the ground. Okay, so let's climb up. Climb up again. So I'm curious. If we accidentally drop from a height, I'm just gonna save the game beforehand. Uh, let's jump over here. Okay. So I'm guessing, yeah, we have a prompt to set up the battle. What happens if I just fall? Do we go boom? No, we do not go boom. Well, slightly disappointing. I'd have loved to see Marvin go boom. Okay, set up a barrel. What was that? Were those, uh... Were those... What the hell was that? Were those birds that I just saw? Huh. I don't think I've ever seen birds in the game. Wait, wait, wait. I gotta see that again. What the hell are those? Are they bugs? Okay, interesting. Never saw that before. Set up a battle. Okay. Can I attack the battle? Can I do something with the battle? Can I do a lightning on the battle? Nope. Doesn't seem like it. I would have loved to detonate the battle. They actually shoot it with a crossbow. Is that gonna do anything? I doubt it. And nope. Doesn't seem like I can shoot the battle with a crossbow either. Oh, it goes through it. I get it. I get it. Okay, so we're down. Uh, Duster. Hey. I'm done. Wszystko gotowe. Doskonale sobie z tym poradziłeś. Czuję, że będziemy się świetnie dogadywać na naszej wyprawie. A z ciekawości, bo przez to całe zamieszczanie zapomniałem spytać, gdzie dokładnie wyruszamy? Do ruin Wardal. Aha, you're shit scared now, aren't you? Wardal? Przecież ta twierdza jest przeklęta! Nie słyszałeś tych wszystkich legend? Spokojnie, byłem już tam z magiem wody Riordianem i oczyściliśmy cały przedsionek. Resztą zajmie się cały oddział wyszkolonych wojowników. Twoim zadaniem będzie jedynie dopilnowanie, byśmy mogli przejść. Dobrze, skoro tak mówisz, obyś wiedział, co robisz i niech ten skarbiec naprawdę będzie pełen złota. 
Okay, what about the battles and the other guards? A co z tymi beczkami i pozostałymi strażnikami? Jeden z chłopaków zostanie na straży i będzie pilnował przejścia. Jeśli zobaczy, że orkowie chcą przejść, to zawoli pół tego wzgórza prosto na ich puste łby. A uh, can you teach me something? Czy... No owszem, mam za sobą. Oczywiście nie za darmo. Okay, so he can teach you something Nauczy... about... Nie mogę cię już... Yeah. Jak can. ciągle myślę, jak przekonać wyżej postawionych ode mnie ludzi do chętniejszego korzystania z prochu w walce, to by nam przecież dało przewagę nad orkami. Yes, it would definitely give us an advantage, advantage over the orcs. Who would have thought that gunpowder technology is a deadly invention? Jesus freaking Christ. Ah, okay, so let's see. Who else do we need to talk to? Uh, let's go to Valerio's vineyard. Actually curious if we're gonna get any other ambushes along the way. Would hope so. We're only 45% to the next level. 57. Probably we're gonna level up two or three more times before... What is this? Who are these guys? This is a random encounter I have not seen before. They look like Volkers, man. Czekajcie. Myślicie, że to on? No raczej, nie inaczej. Opis się zgadza. Ciekawe. Nie wygląda groźnie. Jak to mówią, nie ocenia się książki po autorze. Po okładce. Co? Nie ocenia się książki po okładce, <laughs> Autor nie ma nic do rzeczy. Sam jesteś durniem. Dobra, spokój. Słuchaj, młody, los się do nas uśmiechnął. Zarobiliśmy ostatnio sporo złota. Tymczasem nasze obecne zlecenie zdaje się być nieco... Lewe? Średnie? Do dupy? Cisza! <śmiech> Posłuchaj, tak się niefortunnie złożyło, że otrzymaliśmy zlecenie na twoją głowę. Ale da się to rozwiązać w inny sposób. Symboliczna kwota, tysiąc sztuk złota, jesteś wolny i swobodny. Co ty na to, młody? Tysiąc sztuk złota? Jak to podzielić na czterech? To proste. Igni zbierze 500, ja 300, a wy po stówce. To chyba nie do końca jest sprawiedliwe. 100 sztuk złota będzie łatwiejsze do podziału. O bogowie. Niech będzie. 100 sztuk złota. Na piwo. Co ty na to, młody? What happens if I... <laughs> Give them a hundred gold pieces. Wypijcie moje zdrowie. Dzięki, młody. A ty wypij nasze. I jakby co... Ty nas nie widziałeś, a my nie widzieliśmy ciebie. So that's interesting. We get an elixir of life. And... Za ciemnością podążałem krok za krokiem. Sam. Aż ta ukazała mi oblicze swe. I strach wezbrał w sercu mym, gdy zobaczyłem je. Do światła ruszyłem i tam pozostanę. Aż godzina ostatecznej walki wybije. Teraz, gdy nadchodzi, ruszam w mrok. I pokonam go. Nie ulęknę się. Zaniosę światło ku ciemności. Sam idę tam, gdzie nikt żyw nie był. Co to było? Mój poemat. Mam nadzieję, że kiedyś go ukończę. Does anybody Zabieram know? Zresztą, wykrzywione zębacze, ludzie w białych szatach, ożywieńcy pokonujący okay. paladynów. Skąd się to bierze w mojej głowie? Ja nie miewam snów. I bardzo dobrze. Sny są okropne. I'm actually happy that we spared these guys. może bardzo szpetnego faceta o demonicznej osobowości ubranego w zardzewiałą zbroję? Eee, nie. To dziwne. On się raczej rzuca w oczy. Demonic personality? Is he referencing Dark Souls by any chance? Adi, Ignis, Makot, Reg? Teraz, gdy wszyscy są szczęśliwi lub nie żyją, możemy iść do domu. I'm actually happy that they only ask for uh oh, okay. So I followed the darkness step by step, huh? Ah, that was a that was actually a worthwhile uh encounter. I'm assuming that if we want uh what the hell did I save the game? Yeah, it was here. I'm assuming that let's just do a quick check. I think I can kill them if I want them, right? Oh, I can't actually, huh? Very interesting. Fair enough. I mean, you choose an outcome and you stick with it. Huh. It's a pretty cool uh, random encounter. They are Volkers men, though. 
<clears throat> but what happens if uh, instead we actually do choose to kill them? Do we get to loot their bodies? Is there anything interesting on their bodies? Uh, let's double check. Yeah, 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 yes. Skip through the dialogue, skip through the dialogue. Not Okay. So I just love their um their banter by the way. Enough of those games. Dosyć tych wyciągnijcie broń. Oj, młody. Nie chcesz się dogadać, więc będziesz trupem. Wow! They actually killed us! Huh? Uh, that's actually pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. Okay. Well, in that case, let's do it in melee. I think in melee it's gonna be easier. I actually did sell my geyser spell, right? Yeah, I did sell my geyser spell. Thought I wouldn't really need it. Okay, let's do it in melee. We can do this in melee. I just wanna double check if... Uh... If there's anything interesting in their inventory. I don't think there is. But I'm mostly curious if there's a... If there's a poem. Okay. Okay, now it's gonna be easier. It's just two on one. Okay, and that's one on one. Oh! Oh my god, I was so close! Okay, let's just uh, fast forward until they're dead. It's gonna be easy. Okay, so they're all dead. So let's see, what was all this effort about? What do they have? So Rich doesn't have anything interesting. Makeup doesn't have anything interesting. Addy doesn't have anything interesting. And Ignis doesn't have anything interesting. So all that effort, yeah. This is actually the better uh, outcome to not fight them. <clears throat> you do get more experience, that's true. But it actually feels that uh, permanent... Permanent potion is probably the better choice overall. Luffy! I remember you. Do you have anything for the expedition? Mm, apparently he does not. Okay, I don't see any more of Volker's people around. So, yeah. It just means we're gonna... Go directly to Valeria's Vineyard. And we still... I think this is gonna be... <laughs> There's gonna be another episode where we talk to the people uh, in the city as well. We haven't even uh, gotten to them. And we still haven't recruited the uh, other two warriors. And don't you think I forgot? We're gonna talk to Fane as well. Because we, guess what? We, I waited until this point to recruit Fane for the Vardal expedition. It's gonna be pretty fun. It's gonna join us in Vardal. As an undead skeleton. Okay, so let's see. I don't see any other random encounters over here. There's just two or three people we can talk to here. So, Liam! Hey. How are you doing? So, Liam doesn't have anything new for us. Gumbert! Uh, how's the situation? Yeah. Doesn't have anything to tell me. Okay, good to know. Any... Any good wine? Anything we can potentially buy? No, just some raspberry stuff, which gives us dexterity. Which is actually the most useless stats, stat for Marvin right now. We only really need strength and mana, really. Do the brothers have anything to tell us? Yes. Mógłbyś zapewnić mi trochę zapasów na moją wyprawę? Staram się tu wszystko opanować po tym dotychczasowym chaosie. Nie mogę zajmować się jeszcze wydawaniem żywności. Masz tu klucz do skrzyni w magazynie. Weź z niej co potrzebujesz. Zasłużyłeś sobie. 
Oh, thank you very much. What about hey. Holvik? How's the situation? Duch naszego ojca może być teraz naszą winnicę czek. Thank you very much, Holvik. All right, so he gave us a key to the storeroom. Let's see what we can find in the storeroom. So I'm guessing it's gonna be. Uh, no, this is the quest chest. So provisions from the Valerio Vineyard. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, we can't actually interact with this chest, can we? Can't interact with that either one, huh? Nope. Is this the chest from the? Yeah, this was the from the chapter two quest, I think. Oh yeah. It's probably from the chapter quest. So we talked to Liam. Talked to the guys. There was also one of Volker's mercenaries hanging around here somewhere. I'm actually curious where he might be. And there's a refugee eating a sausage. Is he potentially somewhere around here? Przestań natychmiast z tym czarowaniem. Mądra decyzja. Mądra decyzja. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't tell me that it's a good decision. Seriously, dude. You see me sporting this badass armor covered in steel plate, chainmail, with some fur on it, and a sword that's the size of a large child. And your first response is to draw your sickle that you used to... Oh, there's also Dennis up there. I forgot about Dennis. And your first response is to draw a sickle to me. Seriously. How are you doing? Mm, Two-handed weapons? Nah. Okay. <clears throat> so I think this is enough for this part. Let's go to the city then. And uh, let's see, who can we chat with real quick? What if we can chat with Guard and Griff? Get the warriors for the expedition ready at least. And in the next episode we're gonna finish the final preparations for Vardal. Which means Practically speaking, with, with uh, everybody else in the city, um, speaking with Thane, that's going to be pretty much it. So not this episode, the next episode will be done with the island of Arkelos and we'll be able to finally enter the Vardal Ruins. Yeah, apparently there's a lot of preparations to do, go figure. More preparations that I anticipated. Nival! Nival, Nival, Nival. Citizen, citizen, citizen. Gerstand. Can I buy some provisions? Mogę kupić u ciebie trochę prowiantu? Wybacz, chłopcze, nie sprzedaję swojego zaopatrzenia. Porozmawiaj ze Slagerem. Może on będzie w stanie ci pomóc. Talk to Slager, huh? Slager the Butcher. I can actually roll with that. I can roll with that just fine. Uh, Myro doesn't have anything to tell me. There was also a guy up here at a certain point. Is he still there? He is not. Okay, good to know. Let's, uh, in that case, let's go to our puppy. Tell him that somebody's gonna take care of him. That he's not gonna be ignored. Hey, we can also recruit Ilsa, by the way, from the, for the expedition. But I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I need food. Potrzebuję jedzenia. Wydawało mi się, że masz trochę złota i nie musisz żebrać o jedzenie. Miałem na myśli cały pakunek jedzenia. Dobrze, zapakuję dla ciebie jakieś resztki. Przynajmniej magowie wody nie będą mogli powiedzieć, że moja pomoc dla ubogich to był tylko jednorazowy czyn. Okay, can I buy wine? From Mogę you? kupić od ciebie wino? Ale rzeczywiście. Uh, he doesn't have any other wine. Okay. <clears throat> so, opa. 
What's going on over here? What's going on over here? Is this another random encounter? Czy to twój ogród? Tak, a o co chodzi? Jeszcze się pyta, co za bezczelność. Postawiłeś posąg Beliarowi. Wstydu nie masz. Um, every god deserves to be worshipped. What I have in my garden. Każdy bóg zasługuje na uwielbienie. Każdy, ale nie on. Przestań. Po prostu wyznaję inne wartości i dziękuję Beliarowi za każdą dobrą rzecz, jaka mnie spotyka. Herezja! Jeżeli w mieście pojawią się kolejni kultyści, to będę wiedział, kto to zapoczątkował. Okej, okay, that was uh, pretty Chwila. interesting. O, i no. Okej, okay, I'm... Uh, did I actually ever buy a... Statue of Adonis? Actually, you know what we're gonna do? Let's... Uh, <clears throat> let's pass the time for a day. And uh, rest until the next morning. Sleep well and feel rested. Oh my god, we're gonna say goodbye to our house. Our house that we spend so little time in. Let's uh, visit the furniture lady. Katrina! I like to review your stuff. I actually remember buying... Oh, I haven't really purchased them yet, huh? Cheaper plants. <laughs> Seriously. Okay. Uh, let's uh, sell the stuff, what we have. We don't need so many knives, don't need heavy branches. Uh, do not actually need this food either. Don't need the blue elder. Don't need the fire root. Mother's amulet, ring of the ring of water. Uh, don't actually need more than one, do we? Don't need more than one ice block, definitely. This we can sell. Volkers, shouters. Oh! Okay, so apparently we can't sell that, huh? Interesting. Uh, bear fat, we have way too much. Minecrawler armor plates, way too much. Swamp drone poison, swamp drone rings. Crab shells. Bunch of. Bloodfly things. Mud turtle shells. Way too many. Stings. Way too many. Lizard tongues. Way too many. What else do we have? Fangs. Key from Valeria's vineyard. Can I actually sell this? No. Oh, that's good. A uh, bunch of ore nuggets. Okay. What else can we get rid of? What happens if I buy the Adonis and Inno statues? Small fireplace, maybe some new tables, right? Just for decoration. How much? Uh, your husband doesn't. Uh, yeah, your husband doesn't really help a lot, does he? Um. Okay, let's. Uh, <laughs> It was a pretty funny random encounter. I was actually wondering if I put a statue of Beliar, would anybody even mention it? But apparently they do. The reactivity in this game is freaking awesome. So what happens if I choose a statue of... Enos? Are they gonna get pissed off? If I sleep a day... <clears throat> Somebody gonna complain that I have a statue of Enos instead of a statue of Adonis? Because I'm super curious. Is the game that reactive? Is the game just that well made? Is there anybody outside my house right now? Doesn't seem like it. Maybe we need to sleep a couple of days. Maybe that's gonna... That's gonna do it. So rest until the next morning. Yeah, we're experimenting. We're towards the end of the episode. The Vardal expedition can wait. This is science. Okay. And I'm assuming that if I put a... Um, statue of Adonis, nobody's gonna be... Nobody's gonna be upset about it. 
Because it's a statue of Adams, right? We're not gonna spark a religious war. Half of the island are followers of Adanos. Uh, decorate the garden. Stop a statue of a god. Adanos. Okay. Nobody's uh, mentioning anything so far. I'm just gonna take a quick nap. If nobody says anything, I'm just gonna put a statue of Beliar man. Nobody says anything about the Beliar statue. Yep. Beliar it is then. I'm actually curious. Are we gonna get a fine? So decorate the garden. Set up a statue of a god. Set up a statue of Beliar. He has an awesome statue, by the way. Alright. And take one more nap. One quick nap. I'll rest until the next morning. So, by the way, workforce. Uh, now I need to recruit Varen. What's the time? Day 165. Man, we've almost been half a year on this island. Actually, seems legit. What happens if I pray to... What happens if I offer 50 hit points? What do I get, actually, for the effort? So, if I offer 50 hit points, I get only 500 gold? That's actually very little. Yes, and if we offer nothing to Beliar, it's actually a pretty cool statue now that I look, about, look at him. Huh. Yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna sacrifice 50 full hit points for 500 gold. Like an elixir of life is 1,500 gold pieces and only gives us 20 life, so it's it's really not worth it. You have to be desperate for money. So let's talk to Night Eyes, Puppy. Let's talk to the it's dog. Go. Puppy, I'm gonna say goodbye and lead you to Victor. Zaprowadzimy cię do miejsca, gdzie się tobą zajmą, póki tu nie wrócę. Ja, papi. A. Just go directly to Victor. That's awesome. Where's the pup? Ah, there he is. Hey, ty. Got scared for a second. Co słychać? Oh, he's happy. Victor, here's Night Eyes. Oh. Okay, so we're done here. Alright, so, thank you guys for watching, this is pretty much enough for this episode, gonna see you guys in the next episode where we'll finish all the preparations, we we'll just have to recruit two more people, have to talk to Fane, and uh, just get a few more provisions from the city of Arcalos itself, and uh, talk to Varen, I think that's uh, the only thing left. If I check here quickly, yeah, there's also the Cursed Swamp. I think we're gonna end the episode in the Cursed Swamp. Why not? Why not end it in the Cursed Swamp? Because we need to talk to Fane anyway. So, thank you guys, it's been a blast, I'm really so happy with this game so far, it's freaking cool, freaking awesome. So, gonna see you in the next episode. When we finally say goodbye to all of our friends and acquaintances we've made across the game and enter the dark, mysterious and dangerous corridors of Vardal. So, until next time, remember the most important story in the world. It's not my story, it's not Marvin's story, it's your story. So, have fun guys and take care of yourselves.